Good evening, everyone, and thank you for coming to the channel. That is Deb Chanel Sporty's World. You know where you're at for all the salacious stories in the entertainment news realm, okay? That's where you get it from, Deb Chanel's 40th World. But I want to thank you, thank you, thank you for my new subscribers, for my old subscribers, and some that are on the fence that are thinking about subscribing to me. Come on over. Come on over. One day I'll talk good about somebody that you like. But at the meantime, in between time, just get on board, okay? Get on the Deb Chanel 48th World Train, okay? Get on the caboose. Get on the airplane. I got them all hooked up, okay? But right now, I just want to say thank you for coming to the channel, subscribing to me, sharing my videos, and liking my videos, okay? But as you know, I like it when you subscribe, 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 and you like, 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 subscribe, 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 and you like, 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 hey, like, subscribe, like, subscribe, yes, get on into it, all right? But as we, as you, we can't carry, we can't stay in one field too long, Okay? So that's just my little introduction for the people that have come, that don't know how I get down, and for the ones that know how already how I get down and how I have my sidebars. Okay, get into it. Ain't nothing but to do it, but to get into it. Ain't nothing but to do it, but to get into it. All right, now. Lord, I heard this story yesterday. And of course, you know, I put out that um, Housewives Do's and Don'ts video. So that kind of took a lot out of me. And I kind of went way overboard than where I wanted to go. You know, because I don't like to stay here on one video too long. Queen told me I can't do it like that no more. Uh-uh, people got, got places to go and people to see. Or better yet, things to do other than giving me 30 minutes to an hour of their time. And if it's not exciting, you cut it short. Okay? Okay, so that's what I'm doing, all right? So I feel y'all, I feel y'all. But when I had them long videos, y'all know I got true tea in it. Get into it. Or uh, save it for later. Save it for after you say your prayers and you're ready to go to bed. Or, or, or right before you uh cook something. Put me in the kitchen with you. Just have the thing rolling. Just have me talking in the background. Woo! Okay. But I thought I would fall out on the floor. And y'all know how big I am. Y'all know how big I am. Okay. Woo! And you know my age. My bones are tired. I don't know if I would have got up. If I would have hit the floor. I had to lay there a little while longer. <laughs> Let's see how painful this is going to be when I'm trying to get up. But anyway, Lord, Mama Joyce, Mama Joyce, Mama Joyce. I'm like, Tiny, where is Diane? Where is your Mama Diane? Were you not there at that ceremony that Candy and the rest of the escape group were in attendance? So why did you not tell Mama Joyce to get up on that stage? Because this video is really going to be about the escape, calling themselves getting back together. And Mama Joyce being the driving force. Anybody don't know who Mama Joyce is, get into it. Y'all had to go way, way back to the housewives when pretty much Candy had got on board. She became a, a friend or I don't know how she got on there. Oh, I think Tamika Tiny Cotel. She was supposed to have been on the show initially, but she just passed the torch on to Candy. She said, I ain't got time. Tia won't let me do it. He won't let me do it, Lord. I got to raise these kids. I got to be a good housewife. And he's bringing in the dough. He don't want me to work. And hey, if you got a man like that supporting you on every front, I guess you don't have to work, okay? So she passed that torch. She said, no, nah, I can't do it. I can't do it. So that's how Candy got on. And she's uh very open about how she got the part. They wouldn't check her for Candy. No, they would. But it just is what it is. She's a Fabulous, successful businesswoman as we speak. A household brand name, okay? And she probably was to her family already a queen in her own right. Yes, she was because she was producing and writing music, or at least writing music, selling in the boat. She was still maintaining, maintaining, okay, maintaining. But now she's doing more than maintaining. She is like, whoo, making it rain and everybody and on anybody she want to. And I ain't mad at her, honey. She's a boss, okay? But like I said, this video ain't going to really be about Candy. Except for Candy want to go get her her mother and take her to the nearest island and drop her off for a couple of years. That's probably what she felt about Mama Joyce. She's like, what, what the hell? My mama going to get up there and say some shit like that for I know that's what she was saying because I would have been saying if my daughter did it to me or I did it to my daughter. She'd probably like, what the hell my mama doing? Do she know I'm independent now? I don't get down being a background singer. I'm not a doo-wop girl anymore. Hey, I got the dungeon. I am uh, shining. 
uh, flying and, and profiling out there, okay? I'm glossing. I'm flossing. I'm doing all those things. I don't need to be in the background no more. I don't need to be with a group. What the hell my mama doing? And she possibly can. I'm paying your ass. And your husband try to get us involved in that old LG restaurant when you know good and damn well ain't nobody trying to be up there at our age cooking. Okay, are you crazy? I could, are you crazy? I don't care if it was a, 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 a what do you call that, a, a, a 3.0 or a five star restaurant. I don't give a shit. I ain't got time to be up there with my hair fluffing out because the heat done got to it. I'm tired already because of the steam and I ain't trying to get no massage or uh, having a masseuse rub me down. I ain't got time to be in no kitchen while you and Todd trace around the 52 states and probably going overseas and they're doing, I want to do that. I want to do that. And the way I can do it is get your ass back on the road, okay? That's what you need to go. I ain't into that dungeon mess. I'm not into the dungeon or uh, trip of bread where you're showing your ass and other people's ass and all that stuff. I, 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 no, that ain't even in my league no more. I'm grown. I'm seasoned. I don't want to be fooling with that mess. She probably don't have to babysit too long. She said, I'm can I got to get back on the road where well, I got, I can go see her in concert and all this other stuff, all this dungeon mess. I ain't with it. I ain't with it. And I ain't with that old LG and my sister's birthday and all they on the train with me. They don't want to feel it. They don't want to hear it. No, that's Todd thing. Keep his ass up in that kitchen. You know, two restaurants y'all got named after us. Y'all get up in that kitchen. I ain't finna do it no more. That's what mom just said. She said, so why I got this opportunity? I'm gonna tell the world. I believe Escape got another album they need to put out. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, Mama Joyce was up there just singing the praises and saying, uh -uh, my daughter won't say it, but I'm gonna say it. Okay, and I'm like, wait a minute, Mama Joyce. Did you not hear? Did you not see? Tiny Cotel, Cotel, Cottle, or let's just say T.I.'s wife, Tiny, okay? She out there trying to shake her booty and do her thing. She had already said, I think it was a week or two ago, put in the press, like Carter B. said, I don't need no more press. I don't need no press, 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 okay? Or how y'all young bucks get out there and say that stuff? She said, uh-uh, I don't want to be with Escape. I'm retiring. They know I, I want my own group. I want to be my own entity. I want all the spotlight on me, like a baby Beyonce, okay? And Candy was pretty much saying the same thing. She ain't got time for this, this, this stuff. We made, we self-made women. We got all our accolades and whatever, so we finna just rock. We're doing our own thing. Cruising down our own streets. No, we can't compare to those uh, sisters that can dog go sing, okay? I don't know what they've been doing. I don't know how they weren't successful, but I ain't got time to go back there and throw, you know, them bones. Now, we did this one escape thing. Now, I, I, I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. And I, I'm with them. I'm with them, Candy and Tiny. I don't want y'all to do it either because that error has gone. I mean, you know, you can come up here and do it. I mean, y'all couldn't even get it together. <laughs> y'all couldn't even get it together when y'all came back with that first tour. Okay, Candy want to air right. She was like, ain't nobody coming on time. She's still mad because what they said in the past. She wasn't getting over shit quick enough. Then Tiny had to get on her behind saying, hey, you either with us or you not with us. Damn, make up your mind. We got time going back and forth with you. We trying to do this thing. And I was like, <laughs> and what my daddy had called herself, she don't sell, don't sell on. <laughs> Honey, good times never feel so good. Y'all remember that song? Yes. Candy and Tiny had sailed on into the sunset. They're like, forget this, man. I ain't been, mm -mm, I ain't been doing no group. I ain't got time to be worried about other people, people's feelings, getting upset. Everybody taking their own tour bus when we go out to one event. Why we can't go together? Nah, everybody got to have their own plane. Everybody got to have their own train. No, nah, we ain't got time for that. I'm like, what in the hell, Mama Joyce went up there and said that? I know some rumblings, some rumblings in that household when they got shit. They probably didn't wait. They probably was just fussing in the parking lot inside the car. She probably tell her mom, why you do that? Why you embarrass me? But see, that's why I said, Candy ain't no real G, okay? I don't care what anybody said or, or how they said it. I was like, uh, excuse me, people. Uh, I don't know what I would took the mic from my mom. I was like, y'all know Mama Joy. She, she, she just a little, you know, outspoken. She spoke out of turn. Uh, the ladies are already doing something. Maybe we could cut out a Christmas album or something. But right now we are just all too, uh, invested in our own personal interests. <laughs> 
We would have we would have put that fire out, doused it out, okay, with the flares, with the well not the flares, but the what just that stuff, the fire extinguisher. We would put uh water on it. We would have prayed about it. We would put the uh, uh we call that a big cloth, a, a cloth that it smothers out the um what do you call it the fire or the flame. We would just put a lid on that. I'm like uh uh-uh, uh that ain't gonna happen not in this lifetime. No ma'am, I ain't finna go fuss with them girls no more. I'm too tired and too old. Uh uh-uh. uh. Well I show sure ain't and I ain't finna. I don't have time. I'm like who run the world? We do. Who run the world? Candy and Tiny. Who run the world? <laughs> Ain't got time to be no do wop bag of single girls no more. Wow, Tamika and her sister, uh, Tasha, go out there and uh, what you know, Tamika, the, the sisters, because y'all know Tiny, I just call her Tiny, y'all know the two Tamikas or whatever, however y'all get down. But I'm talking about the Scott sisters, okay? I know they ain't Scott, Scott, I think both of them are married at this time, but it just is what it is, okay? But though she threw a big wrench in there, and I was like, oh my goodness. But they handle it, I guess, appropriately, how you probably would handle it. But, child, please, I can't wait to see that debacle starts to unravel and unfold. Because it's going to be a mess. If they couldn't get it together then, and that was, what, two years ago, a year ago, something like that. How Mama Joyce said they're going to get it together now? Ken ain't hurt for no money. And damn, so Tiny definitely ain't hurt for no money. So the only two week links. That do have the voices to do something, they all eager. You could just see they were eager beagers, but they knew nine times out of ten, it ain't finna get off the ground. <laughs> it ain't finna get off the ground. No way. But anyway, I had my fun. I tear it too long. But let's get into this article that Kirsten Willis brought to me for uh, breakfast this morning. Yes, she did. Flew over there. On my social media feed, sent straight from her, from Atlanta Black Star, the employer she's working for, it, hashing out all of those wonderful, wonderful, salacious stories in the entertainment field. Okay, let's throw hands up for Kirsten Willis over there. Okay, let's go on. She gives us the title of Surprise! Escape agrees to do one more album thanks to Mama Joyce exclusive. Okay. Escape was recently honored with at the 2019 Black Music Awards or honors in a surprise moment. Candy Burris, mother, disclosed that the music icons are headed back into the studio to record a new album. Okay. She produced her own team. Don't know if it's real or will it ever happen. I'm just pointing out my opinions on the subject and how it's unfolded. Don't know, like I said, if it's a true story or not. Okay, so don't jump on me. Don't come for me or any of uh, anything of that fashion. Okay, just take the tea how it's brought to you, and you digest it however you want. Okay. Uh, going back, it says Burris, along with group members Tiny Harris, Latasha, and Tamika Scott, were present at the award ceremony, which took place in Northwest Atlanta on September fifth. They were granted the Urban Music Icon Award. But after inviting their mothers up during their acceptance speech, Burr's mom, Mama Joyce, whom fans would recognize from the Real Housewives of Atlanta, stepped up to say that the platinum selling R&B quartet is not through recording just yet. <laughs> and once Mama Joyce would have been on that microphone, I would have just snatched it from behind her saying, no, 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 no. My mother misspoke. We'll clear it up in some uh, RP stunt that we, or PR stunt we're going to get together. But no, nah, don't, don't, don't take that literally, okay? That's what mom wants us to do. But we're, we we women, we got too much going on on our place. That's when Candy should have stepped in and just snatched that mic from her mom. But okay, I don't know if she would have snatched it. Uh, Mama Joyce probably would have popped it in the head. I don't know because you know them reflexes when your children act up. Them mama reflexes just be like, you know, they quit. They quit, honey. You got to, we got duck and dodge, them things, all right? But moving back to the uh, commentary, it says, they still have one album left, Joyce said, to the thunderous applause at the Cobb Energy Performing Arts Center Thursday night. The four of them, they started in my basement, and I feel that they still have another album in them. I said, Lord, Mama Joyce needs to stop. <laughs> 
Joy needs my Bravo need to give Mama Joyce her own show. Cause I will show be there every episode, every season, just watching her clown and cut up and cuss people out. Yes, I would in her own stand up fashion. All right. But she put them girls on the spot. And I know Tiny and <laughs> Daddy was like too fit to be tired. Like, okay, we finna do a mafia hit right now. <laughs> And go drop my mama off, and we ain't gonna pick her up. We're gonna give her food, but we ain't gonna get her no telephone, none of that, no amenities, just the basic needs because she shouldn't have put me out like that. She know I got plans with this dungeon thing. I ain't got time to go on no tour with no uh, women that I really don't even socialize with. <laughs> oh my goodness. You see, I'm still chuckled about it because I can just feel their frustration when Mama Joyce did that. Okay, I can still see it. Candy Pop said, man, I bought you a new car. I bought you a, a new house or I renovated it. I give you everything you want. Then you're going to come up here and do this to me in front of all these folks embarrassing me, Mama. Oh, Lord, I can only wonder. I wish I was a fly on the wall. I wish I was a fly on the wall. But going to the com- back to the commentary, it says the a Revelation Stone Escape and Members. Burris and Harris explained their reaction exclusive, exclusively to Atlanta Black Star backstage. Obviously, she put us on the spot, but I mean, as Stutter and Burris said, following this ceremony, I guess we're going to grant her wish. I didn't know what to say, but at the same time, she put it out there. My group members are here. We're going to make it happen. We're going to figure it out. And see, she said her group members, like, I'm like, girl, Katie, you ain't got, you ain't got no pool in the state, girl. They didn't want you down. You know you the do walk girl. You the backup singer. Hey, they ain't going to try to bring you out in the spotlight, girl. You know who they came to see. But anyway, moving on. Back to the article. It says, Ads Harris. Yeah, when everybody's scheduled, get together. We're going to get <laughs> in that studio. See, her and Tiny are playing a nice nasty. They ain't trying to get to no studio. They're going to make Mama George look like a fool. For they get up there and look like a fool and work with some people they don't want to work with. Especially when they got their own identities going on. Their own individual products to shine by themselves. Chocolate. But anyway, uh, going back to the article, says Mama Joyce also discussed her on stage a mission saying I feel like Candy uh, just needs to get with them and they need to finish that one last album. They all got the voice. They voice is just as good if not better than it was back 25 years ago. <laughs> like Mama Joy, have you heard them girls? Have you heard them girls the last time they were in the studio and trying to do choreography and all of that? Mama Joy, who you in the same room, baby girl? <laughs> Like, no, Mama Joy, two of them were still in sync with the music, but the other two, come on now, Mama Joy, I know you love your daughters, your daughter, and I kind of appreciate her on a good turn myself, but I always knew Candy was a backup. A uh, singer and dancer. She wasn't, uh uh-uh, uh, even now she ain't fit for no front time Beyonce starting her uh, uh, own show. Uh uh-uh, uh, no, but she wants to be there. Yes, she do. And I ain't got nothing but love for her. Go on, do your thing, girl. Go on, do your thing. Okay, but going back to the article, it says, Meanwhile, fans of Escape eagerly sounded off on a fan account for the understanding performers. Says, She never lied. Let's go. Come through with that album at Major Girl at Candy at the Real Tamika Sky. I am Latasha, please. Mother has spoken. <laughs> like that ain't the rest of the other women, Mama. That's Candy Mama just flying out the seat of her pants, showing out. Okay, going back to the article, say a highly anticipated fourth album. Studio album from the skate has yet to materialize in the last several years, despite fans' desires for it. During an appearance on uh, Watch What Happened Live in November 2017, Latasha eagerly answered in the affirmative when asked if new music was coming. But Burris quickly pointed out that it will only be Latasha, her sister Tamika, and Tiny who will be heading to the recording booth studio. I'm going to do Broadway and some other things that are going to be uh, I'm going to be doing with my music. That's what Candace said. We know we see how that. Broadway thing turned out for her. <laughs> it wasn't really what she thought that was. It. Okay. Ooh, it wasn't, what do you call it, uh, lucrative for her, I should say. But moving back on to this article, 
It said a few months later, Burst explained why she wasn't interested in recording new material with her group members. As soon as the girls and I started talking initially, I told them I didn't really want to do new music. And the main reason is because I feel like I don't want to mess with our legacy. Burris told Madame New York in January 2018, when we were a group, we had three platinum albums. All of our albums were hits. We never had a flop album, and the things are not how they used to be back in the day. And it goes on and on and on, <laughs> but, you know, I don't want to tear it too long, okay, because I'm already in my 20 minutes zone. But I'm like, Candy do not have any solace about uh, or peace of mind if she's going to get back and get headaches with them uh, uh, three women, okay? She can barely deal with Tiny, okay? But she love herself some Tiny. All right, they have their own strange type of uh, friendship, okay? But Tiny already had to get her straight in that parking lot. Girl, you either with us or you not. You either with us or you not, Candy. I ain't even had this shit, okay? And I'm down for Tamika. I sure will go back in my archives and you can see when they tried to escape um, um, we call it a little show they gave them a little spin off from Bravo. Uh, yeah, it was very successful, and I I could have did a little lot more videos on them because they were just exceptional women. <laughs> you no know, cutting up, showing their real personalities. Okay, now not like back in the day and all this kind of stuff. It was exciting. I had fun doing those videos, Tiny, because they gave me realness. And Tiny show gave it to me. She sure did. She's like, uh-uh, I'm going to be the mother around him. I'm going to be whooping ass, taking names, because I ain't going to go through the shit we went through when we were little. Okay? I got things to do. Okay? I got people to see. I got more businesses to create and all of that. <laughs> she was breaking it down, girl. So I'm, yeah, yeah. Go on and try to get this shit off the road. Go on and try to get it off the ground, because I'm going to be right there. Doing my commentary and giving it to y'all how I see <laughs> fit, all right? But that's all I had, y'all. I'm still laughing because I said, Mama Joy, Mama Joy just had me just, I don't know, just, she just take my breath away. <laughs> Mama Joy be on it. She be stars and stirring up shit, okay? And I'm here for it. Lord, that woman don't even know her, but her spirit is just. Breathtaking, breathtaking. I think can to be like, Mama, don't you say that? Don't you don't you go? I mean, she had conferences. <laughs> she had meetings with her mama. And see, Mama Joe saying <laughs> she ain't gonna get out the house of candy no time soon. Because see, it's on candy back and how she is perceived in the public about wanting to work with um her other cast members, <laughs> her group members. All right. Because all of them are one. You know what I'm saying? There ain't no one better than the other one. At least that's how they see it. But we all know who the true singers are. Okay? In escape. So, Candy, I ain't going to take no second back seat no more. I ain't going to be playing um, a backfielder for somebody. <coughs> Child, I don't got, I don't got you. But, uh, y'all, that's all I got for this video. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Please share it. Like, um... Subscribe to my channel as usual. You know, I love it when y'all subscribe, 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 like, 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 okay? But I'll see y'all next video, y'all. <laughs> I gotta go.